You know the magnetic field, the lens magnets, and also forces the charged particles to move along the magnetic field. So the solar corona is at a million degrees. At a million degrees, hydrogen becomes fully ionized. All the protons and electrons that you have in the solar corona will be forced to move along the magnetic field. So that's why when you look at images like this, you're basically tracing the magnetic field. Okay. Uh, so basically you have the large loops. This is gas, that is, this is plasma, hydrogen is trapped along the magnetic field. The density here is high, so is the temperature. So you basically use this emission as a tracer of the magnetic field structure. The question is, how do you get to the million degrees? How do you hit up the plasma? Here is one possible scenario. So this is a nice cartoon. Here are the magnetic field, convective cells. Here we have suppressed convection. These are the footprints of the magnetic field in the photosphere, or our sunspots. And remember, there is always convection surrounding these sunspots. Okay? What convection does is it introduces disturbance. It's like constantly shaking the surface. It's constantly, if this is your magnetic field, Okay, two ends, you constantly shake the two ends. You launch waves at the level of the photosphere due to the constant convection. And when you perturb the magnetic field, you launch waves. Okay? What do these waves do? They travel along the magnetic field. Or some of them travel transfer the magnetic field, but you have some waves that travel along the magnetic field and they carry energy from the photosphere higher up into the solar corona. And at certain height, you have some conditions at which the waves will deposit their energy and they will just heat up the surrounding material. So this is one way to heat up the corona. You launch waves at the base of the magnetic field. These waves carry energy into some height. At that height, uh, your waves dump their energy. They hit the surrounding corona. and They produce your high ionization, high temperature. This is one of the mechanisms. This is the so-called wave mechanisms to heat so the corona. 